Hello, hello, beautiful humans. It's your friend, Melissa, and welcome back to my YouTube channel and a brand new video. Today, we're going to do some thrifting. I'm in a place called Maitland, and they have a Salvos here and a Lifeline. So we're going to go to the Salvos first and see if we can find anything interesting, anything that I'm interested in. And then we're going to go to the Lifeline, and um, that's a really big store. It's one of my favorites. So I usually have quite a bit of luck there. So we'll see how we go. Um, stay tuned for the end of this video because I will be doing a thrift haul because my best girl my best friend we went thrifting the other day and I found so many awesome things so I'm going to do the haul at the end of this video so that should be a lot of fun I'm really excited to show you guys the things I found when I was thrifting with my friend oh, so many awesome things but we're gonna see if we can find anything else at these little thrift stores today so uh, come along for the journey today and let's get stuck into the op shopping <laughs> Thank you. 
So guys, welcome to the thrift haul portion of this video. I have a few things to share with you that I found uh, when I went thrifting with my friend and also when I went thrifting with myself in this video that you would have just seen. So let's get stuck into the haul. Now, I believe I got these things when I was thrifting with my friend. The first thing I can see is this little horse care book. This is lovely. I have quite a few of these types of books, but you just learn something new from every sort of book that you find. So I picked this up and I believe it was only around a dollar. doesn't have the um, actual price in there, but it's just got a lot of really good tips and you know, you can never learn too much. So I picked that one up. Then the other item that was just in that little bag is this top. I love this color. Now this is uh, from Dotty originally and it's a size small. They took the price off, but I believe it was only around $5 or so. Um, I, yeah, I just love this color. It's just such a nice color. And I thought for a size small, it's quite big for like a little crop. And I love this. I'll wear this probably with jeans or with a skirt. Now I picked this jacket up at the Salvos when I was thrifting with my friend. And this was, I can find the tag, yes. It was $12. I did not mind paying that at all because I love this color. It's one of my favorite colors. And I love the whole Sherpa lined look. Fantastic. The original brand is Boohoo. I was a little bit nervous that this would be like a little bit small on me. It doesn't really do up, but I don't really do up my jackets anyway. But I'll try this on, even though it's like super hot in here. So it looks like this. So of course it is, oh, well, it does up a little bit. It's a UK 12 and usually I like my jackets to be either like a 14 or a 16 or even bigger. I like them quite big, but this is fantastic. I love it. And it's quite long. It goes down quite long. So it just goes down to about here just past my waist. It's just such a nice jacket. I realized all the clothes that I picked up are pretty much the same color. I got this shirt. This was also from the Salvos and it was $6. There we go. And it's just a waffle knit little top. And I mean, I, I am like, I call myself the t-shirt queen because I love graphic tees. I pretty much live in them. Uh, but I need sort of just plain tops as well that I can wear with things like with um, skirts that have prints on them. That's that kind of thing. So I just think this is nice. I would uh, tuck this into jeans or a skirt or even shorts. I just, yeah, I love this a little button down waffle knit. You can imagine I was pretty excited to find this uh, horse print scarf. This is absolutely gorgeous. I only have like an, another scarf. I actually purchased it from Timu during winter to wear um, at, when I'm out riding and things like that. But it's a gray color. This, I love this color. This is so lovely. Horse print, <gasps> fantastic, really cute, perfect for winter. And it was only $3 and that was from the Salvos as well. Another item I picked up from the Salvos was this vest. And this will be worn in winter as well because it'll be way too hot for me to wear this now. This was only $6 and it's one of these puffy vests. It is quite small, but I really liked it. I wouldn't actually wear this done up. And I love this color. I have other vests like this, but not as cropped and not in this color. I think it's so adorable. That is so cute. <gasps> I love this. Oh my gosh. And it was originally, I think, yeah, originally from H&M. Also from the Salvos, I found this little Wrangler tee. It's a really cute little pink Wrangler top. It was $7. Totally worth it. It's also a small size, but it's quite stretchy. Like it's quite big. So I think it's been worn in really nicely. So yeah, it's like a small size definitely for me, but it, uh, it works. It's just nice and fitted and it's not cropped or anything. And I just love this pink color. So that's gonna come in handy. I'm gonna style that up. Now this set I did buy while I was thrifting with my friend. I was looking at this for ages and I was like, oh, should I get it? Should I not? Should I get it? Should I not? Cause I wasn't sure if the top would fit, but I really love the skirt. I knew the skirt would fit. I did try the skirt on. Uh, I couldn't try the top on because of my wrist brace. Um, it's a little bit tricky to try long sleeve shirts on that have sort of fitted, but I'll show you what the set looks like. It was $18. And I absolutely love this. It's originally from Sports Girl, I believe. The tag is somewhere, but it was Sports Girl. And I think this is just so pretty. I love the print. If I can get it close up, it's very bohemian. It's got ruffles. It is just pretty. I love the color. This green is so beautiful. It's got pink throughout, pink and lilac. I just thought this was beautiful. So I can't wait to actually just style this up with a belt and some cowboy boots and the top. Um, oh, so it is a, the set is a size 16 from Sports Girl. 
And oh yeah, this was from Church for Life, the Church for Life op shop. This was while I was thrifting with my friend. I don't know if the top's gonna fit me. I think it might, but if it doesn't, one of my sisters might actually wear this top, but it's so pretty as well. I don't know if you guys know, but I am photo crazy. I take photos all the time. I love photos, photography. It's a hobby of mine and it makes me so happy. I just want to take photos of everything so I can remember everything. And I um, found this frame and I thought this was excellent for my photos. So this was $4 and it's a sideways little frame and it's timber. I really love this look as well. Also, I found this DVD. I've never seen this movie, but I do love Shannon Doherty and it was so sad that she passed away this year and I'm actually really looking forward to watching this movie. It's a Christmas movie, it has Shannon Doherty in it. So, and I think this was only around $1. I just thrifted a few little horse items. This is so cute. This is actually a Disney uh, little, I think Disney on ice, yeah. This is a nice little horse. Oh, Piglet, you want to come in, Baba? Say hello. Hello, everybody. There's Piggy. Say hello, Baba. Oh, you just burped. <laughs> You've been eating. Good boy. Hey, precious. I've got to clean his eyes. Hey, Baba. I think he's been asleep. Oh, good boy. He's 15 years old now. Aren't you, baby? Oh, I love him so. <laughs> good boy. It's actually really hot in this room, so he's probably not going to stay in here very long. You want to sleep on mama? You okay? What are you doing? Baba. You want to sit on the floor? Okay. Then I picked up these horse figurines and with these little plastic and acrylic uh, figurines I put these in this room here. This is my closet room and so they will adorn this room at some point when I tidy it up because it's a mess. When I was thrifting with my friend she found these earrings. I was like oh my gosh yes I need to get these. These were one dollar each for the sets and she found this one, the horseshoe. I think these are so cute. And then I got these little sets. It's got like, um, they're just studs and it's boots and hats. I thought that was so cute. And then from the previous footage you would have just watched, I only found a few items when I went thrifting on my own. I'm pretty picky with things. It's got to be horse related or Western related, you know. <laughs> but I found this little uh, quilted pillowcase. So it's obviously a little kid's pillowcase. It looks like this. And I don't know if they've left the tag on of how much it was. I believe, I believe it was only around $2. It was quite inexpensive. I thought what I might do is try to sew this onto a denim jacket because this is a really cute horse. It's very big and I love like the patchwork. It's very pretty. I thought, yeah, I could maybe have a go at sewing that on the back of a denim jacket. We'll see how it goes. But I think it would look amazing. Sorry if you can hear snoring, that's Piglet. And I picked up this DVD. I don't know if any of you guys have seen this movie, Wish Upon a Star. It's such a great movie from like, I think the 90s. Catherine Heigl, I think it's Daniel Harris, yeah. I love this movie. It's pretty magical. It's just all about, it's very 90s. You gotta see it. And then last up, I just picked up a few little books. I love um, horse books I, and like vintage horse books. Sometimes I get them for myself. Sometimes I'll give them to my niece and nephew. I think I'm gonna keep this one. This is a vintage horse storybook. It's a, a riding holiday and it's just really lovely. It's probably a book I might keep, um, yeah, for a while because it's a vintage one. Then I found this one, The White Horse and Other Stories. And this is a more of a storybook. And I think I've got a few of these. I was going to give these to my niece and nephew at some point. They're really lovely little books. And then I found this book and I think I'm gonna keep this for myself because I've never seen this book before. It's Sophia the Show Pony. This reminds me of that, that mouse, that mouse, like what's it called? Claris the Mouse or something. I think this is lovely. So I'll probably end up keeping this in my little uh, cute little book collection that I've got going. That's adorable. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this thrift vlog and thrift haul. Let me know what you guys have been finding in your local thrift stores and op shops. And I'll see you in my next video very, very soon. Have the best day, guys. Bye.